Okay, real quick, the difference between intramolecular and intermolecular. So intramolecular, intra, that means within, like intravenous, within a vein. Actually, we don't really say this much in chemistry. We're more apt to talk about intermolecular forces. That's because when we say intramolecular, well, we have the ionic bond, covalent bond, or metallic bond. So we would rather just say ionic bond, covalent bond, or metallic bond than intramolecular. And these are fairly strong bonds compared to intermolecular forces. When we talk about intermolecular forces, we're talking about between molecules. Think about the word international relations. It's the relations between nations. It's between different nations. And intermolecular forces are between different molecules. So you had two water molecules here, and these two water molecules, they have a weak bond. This is called a dipole-dipole interaction, and it's based on the polarity of the water molecules. Some dipole-dipole interactions are called hydrogen bonding. So this is a type of dipole-dipole, and it's pretty strong. It's important in biology. You'll see it quite a bit. And then the weakest of them is London dispersion forces. If you need help understanding how to classify a compound as dipole-dipole, hydrogen bonding, or London dispersion forces, there's links in the description. Here, I just want you to understand, in chemistry, you're probably not going to hear intramolecular forces. You're going to hear about these intermolecular forces, and they're pretty important. You'll hear about them quite a bit. That's it. This is Dr. B, looking at the difference between intramolecular and intermolecular. Intermolecular, it's between two or more different atoms or molecules. Thanks for watching.